I'm here again with another haul. This time I have a curly hair um, drugstore curly hair product haul. Summer has begun and it is curly hair season. Well, it's been curly hair season for me since like the end of spring, but that's okay. Um, for those of you who are just starting your curly hair um, season, routine, whatever, um, I have some new drug, some some new drugstore products and some old ones that I want to share with you guys um, that I just purchased. So let's get started. Some of them I did use already. I'll talk a little bit about it if I already used it. Um, so let's start with Shea Moisture. I got. Um, I literally have a whole box of things. Um, I got their coconut and his. Coconut and hibiscus curl enhancing smoothie with silk protein and neem oil. Um, and this is for thick curly hair, and my hair is thick and it's curly and it's a hot mess. Um, I've been using this already. Let me see here. I took out my rope twist last week, and um, when I did my hair, I used this. And you can see how thick this is. You can see how thick it is, like that is super thick. So it really nourishes your hair and gets in there and really deeply moisturizes it and that's what I love about this product. So um, I absolutely love this. I have to get another one just to have as backup and because I use it in my hair and Jade's hair. So this is the Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie, which a lot of people already know about because um, many natural hair People on YouTube use this already. I also got their coconut and hibiscus curling gel souffle with agave nectar and flaxseed oil and it's also for thick curly hair and both of them are for anti-fridge moisture and shine and um, they're sulfate free and color safe for if you have colored hair and this is the curling gel souffle and um, it's basically a styler so um, it's in like the same size container as the um, curl enhancing smoothie and this is what it looks like. And the last thing I got from Shea Moisture is their Manuka Honey and Mephora Oil Intensive Hydrating, hydrating Hydration Conditioner with African Rock Fig and Bobob Oil and it's a dry hair recipe is what it says. And um, it's just a conditioner, and I used it to condition my hair when I washed it after I took out my twist. And um, I like it, it's very moisturizing, and it leaves your hair very soft and easy, easy to manage. So that's that, and it comes in a bottle with a pump. And um, yeah. Okay, next um, from the Curls line, I only got one product. I got their Blueberry Bliss Curl Control Paste, and I've used this already. Um, I think it's okay. It kind of reminds me of jam where it kind of gets like a greasy texture. It does have decent hold, but it's not like super strong hold. Um, I think, like I said, it reminds me of jam, how like you'll put it on and it'll be like held down slick, but then it'll start like kind of, your hair will start curling up because it kind of gets just like this greasy look. I don't know how to explain it, but um, this one, it smells so damn good though. They have another one. I forgot what the other um, scent is, but the other one doesn't smell that great. And it's cheaper, I think, because it doesn't smell great. But the blueberry one is it's like a dollar more because it smells really good. Oh my gosh. This thing smells so good. The next product I got is by um, Mix Chicks, and everybody knows about this. I haven't tried it yet, so I was like, oh my god, it's $20. The bottle is so small, but I must try it. So. Like I said, it was 20 bucks, and it's their leave-in conditioner that everyone talks so highly of, so speaks so highly of, so I really, really wanna try it. And I'm gonna use it in my hair and my daughter's hair. I'm actually doing her hair tomorrow, and my hair tomorrow. So um, we will see how I like it. <laughs> the next um, couple of products are from the As I Am line. I've used their co their coconut co-wash before and I love it. I was actually going to purchase that again, but they didn't have any. They were sold out at Walmart, so I just got the Hydration Elation Intensive Conditioner. It's a deep conditioner, and this was really expensive as well. I think it was like $15, um, the Hydration Elation by As I Am. And I also got their um, smoothing gel. Um, which is just a gel, it's a styler. <laughs> so 
I haven't tried any of their stylers or leave-in conditioners, so that's why I went ahead and got these. And like I said, I was going to get the coconut co-wash again, but they were sold out, so I have to get it another time. I don't necessarily have to haul it because I've had it before and I've shown you guys it before. So this is the smoothing gel. Okay, I got one product from Design Essentials, and this is their Natural Honey Curl Forming Custard with Honey and Chamomile. Um, so... It kind of reminds me of the the way it looks in the bottle. It kind of looks kind of like the Shea Moisture Gel Souffle. Um, but anyways, it's by Design Essentials and it's supposed to have natural honey in it. So that's I guess where it gets its color from. So this is what it looks like. And I'm excited to try this because um, I've had their leave-in conditioner before. I wasn't a big fan of it so hopefully their gel does better. Um, a lot of people have been using Design Essentials these days, but um, I personally wasn't a big fan of it. So like I said, hopefully this changes my mind about their brand again. <laughs> um, I did get a Carol's Daughter product. I got one thing from their line. I got it from, uh, I got their uh, hair milk um, refresher spray and it's to deeply moisturize, improve softness, prevent frizz, and it has agave, sweet almond, and wheat protein in it. And I just think this would be great for my hair for when I do like twist outs or even my, my puffs like this. I can just spray it and kind of have the curls bounce back to life. So that's why I got this product. And it's in a nice big spray bottle and it's a lot of liquid. It's 10 fluid ounces. So that's kind of a lot, even though you're spraying it. So you'll probably be using a lot of it. Um, yeah, I think it's good. A lot of people speak highly of Carol's Daughter, and this is my first time trying out anything from their line, so I'm excited to get get you know get going with that as well. Okay, and I got one item from the Miss Jessie's line, and it's the leave-in condition soybean plus aloe. It's a leave-in conditioner. It says the best darn leave-in conditioner period, and a lot of her products says that. Um, now with this, I tried it. I used it on my hair when I washed my hair before I got my twist. I used this on my hair. I did not like it. I don't know if I just need to give it another chance, but I did not like the way it felt. It felt like plasticky, like rubbery. Um, almost like it wanted to be sticky, but I will give it another go and get back to you guys with my real opinion when I do a review. Um, the next item I got is from Organics. And I used to always buy their coconut milk shampoo and conditioner. I used when I had when my hair was relaxed. That's all I used to use on my hair when that first came out. Because I remember I was working at CVS in high school, and their line came out, and they had all these different scents. And the coconut one smelled so good. I was like, I have to get it. I have to have to have to get it. So I got their coconut curls conditioner, and um. It says, drench your curls. This nourishing, nourishing blend with coconut oil, sweet honey, and a twist of citrus oil helps to enhance natural softness, boost decadent spirals, and tame frizz for beautiful tumbling waves with bounce and shine. And um, it's sulfate free, and I decided to just get it to try it because I have not tried anything from their curls line. I didn't even know they had a curls line. Um, so yeah, and they also have one that's like, um, it's like water or something. It's like clear and the bottle is clear so you can see it. I have to get that one too. But um, I got this one for now. I'm going to try that first. And then the next thing I got is from a line I've never heard of. It's called Not Your Mother's Kinky Moves Curl Defining Hair Cream. And it's infused with grapeseed and jasmine extracts. And it says NIM, N-Y-M. I'm not sure who that is. I guess that's the person who makes it maybe. It's by NIM Brands. Um, yeah, so um, it comes in this tube and it's a curl defining cream, so it's a styler. And I'm excited to use this um, because I've never heard of this brand before. So hopefully it's really good. And um, yeah, so I will let you guys know all about this. If you guys have heard of this brand before, let me know if you've tried it or anything like that. I haven't, so yep. The last two products that I got are from Garnier. You know, I couldn't leave Walmart without getting Garnier products. So apparently they have a curl nourishing line now. So, um, and not the, not the other one, like the, from the line that I got before, the whole, the whole blends, not that line. Um, 
This one is from their Curl Nourish line and it's new and it they have the shampoo, conditioner, everything for this line, the cream, the conditioning cream, like the one they used to have in the green bottle, they have that one but it's like an orange bottle. The color for this line is orange. So I decided to get the fortifying conditioner um, to use as a co-wash and it says um, it's for dry curly hair and it has coconut, jojoba, and macadamia oils and natural glycerin in it and those things are all good for your hair and it is sulfate free. A lot of drugstore brands are going sulfate free now because they know a lot of naturals. They want to have, you know, good products in their hair that's not going to strip it of all its nutrients and things like that and that's not going to cause other issues like a dry scalp and things like that. So that's good that it's sulfate free and um, it says it richly nourishes uh, for stronger, more defined, frizz resistant curls. I'm excited to try this because my hair is obviously very frizzy just because of the type of curls that I have. I have really coily curls. And then lastly, I got their Marvelous Oil Deep Nourish 5 Action Hair Elixir and this is new from them as well. And it's for dry damaged air, hair. It has Kapuaku and Brazilian Brazil Nut Oil. And it nourishes hair, um, it gives supreme shine. And like I said, it's for dry damaged hair. I really love this. It's really thick and it does nourish your hair. I used it when I did my hair the last time, like I said. I used this and I used the Curl Enhancing Smoothie and I used Eco Styler Gel. And oh my god, my hair was like on fleek. Um, I haven't really done nothing to my hair since then, so that's why it looks like this, but I'm gonna do my hair tomorrow. And um, this is what it looks like. It's in this like clear bottle. And it's really thick. You could tell it's thick from just looking at it in the bottle. You can just tell it's thick. And like I said, thick, um, when products are thick, they really nourish and penetrate your hair really good and keep the moisture locked in. Um, yeah, so that's everything, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you so much for watching. Later.